down. The Eagles 19 on first down. Manning to the end zone. Incomplete. And Tammy followed it. And then lost the handle. A great job by Peyton Manning with a pump fake to the top. It's a double move, but he's coming back down below. Great catch up by Akeem Jordan. He was beat, gets his hand up, gets that ball knocked out. Got to have control all the way to the ground. Second and ten, three receivers off the play thing. Manning fires. This time, the intended receiver, Anthony Gonzalez. And you wonder if there's going to be a little bit of an adjustment between Peyton Manning and Anthony Gonzalez. There has to be. I mean, for years, Peyton Manning has thrown that ball to Marvin Harrison. I bet you they could do it blindfolded. They've done it so many times. So there will be a little bit of an adjustment as these two start to build their chemistry as quarterback and wide receiver. Marvin Harrison, the Colts' all-time leading receiver, released during the offseason back home in Philadelphia. Manning on third and ten. His pass is caught by Joseph Matai for a first down inside the Eagles' five. Well, that's a nice throw by Peyton Manning. There's really not a whole lot of area to fit this ball in. Here comes Joseph Adai out of the backfield. Little wheel route down the sideline. Takes a hit at the end, but just drops it right into a real small area for a chance at this catch by Joseph Adai. Good coverage by the Eagles. Just a great throw and catch. First and goal from the three. Manning uses his first time out. Colts started his drive back at their own 19-yard line. First and goal when we come back. Tonight's game on Fox is sponsored by Bud Light. With just the right taste that never fills you up, the difference is drinkability. Back in Indianapolis. Colts on the move. Austin Colley in the slot, number 17. One of the new people we're talking about. Vying for that third wide receiver position. Motion inside by Anthony, Anthony Gonzalez. Now he's got to push that a little bit more and get some separation from Anthony Gonzalez. You saw how close they were. Now, right away, Peyton, you know, hey, Austin, you know, you're, you're about five yards away from that guy. we got two guys in the same spot. we got to get that fixed. I mean, one of the best guys at getting everybody on the same page. They do a little thing on practice. We did it in Indianapolis game a couple of years ago. They do a segment on Friday where Peyton goes over everything with the wide receivers, landmarks, where he expects them to be because he's watched so much film on the defense. Very impressive to watch him work with his teammates on the outside. Following the timeout, first and goal from the three. Dante Samuel on the coverage. Manning was looking for Gonzalez. Anthony Gonzalez has got to finish that route. Now, Asante Samuel, smart corner on the outside. He's waiting on slant. He beats Anthony Gonzalez to the point. So Anthony Gonzalez now has to get across the face of Asante Samuel. That means he has to get in between Asante Samuel and the ball that has been thrown by Peyton Manning. Very fortunate not to have an interception in the end zone. Hey! On second and goal, Manning to Gonzalez, touchdown! So what do you do if the corner is sitting on the slant? You go to the outside. I tell you what, that's impressive right there for Peyton Manning and Anthony Gonzalez to have that type of feel on that round. That is not an easy throw for a quarterback and a, and a wide receiver to execute because Asante Samuel's trailing that as they go to the corner. But he's not in bad position. That's just a great throw and catch. Shane Andrus coming in for the injured Adam Vinatieri. Adds the point after. 
12-play, 81-yard drive. 7-0 Colts. Peyton Manning says that's more like it after the rough start for the Colts offense last week. Oh, that's a great drive. Remember, Asante Samuel made a nice play on a slant before this. Now watch him jump to the inside. Now, I don't know if that's an adjustment between Anthony Gonzalez and Peyton Manning or if that's just great anticipation with the play call. But look at this throw. And, and, and people are like, hey, just throw the hitch to the outside. You throw the hitch when you get down in the red zone. It is not an easy throw, especially against a corner like Asante Samuel. There was not a lot of room there. Remember, I mean, that's Peyton Manning used to throwing that to Marvin Harrison. Kickoff by Andrews, taken at the four by Quentin Getz. Getz out across the 30 before he was tackled by Ramon Humber. Donovan McNabb, the five-time pro bowler, leads the Eagles offense out. Donovan McNabb, not, not particularly pleased with Joe Banner when he made his statement.